weekly stimulus, guys, for the final week of May, uh, Monday the 27th, Memorial Day. Hopefully most of you guys are uh, resting up with Murph or enjoying your Memorial Day. Thank you, veterans. Tuesday. Tuesday, we are continuing our sprint intervals. These are fast rounds, guys. All right, so basically, you got about two minutes to do the round. So if you have to scale back the run a little bit, that's the spot to scale back. All right, 200-meter um, run. As soon as you come in, you'll do one legless or regular rope climb. You'll then jump up and over the box for seven reps, all right? And then you'll do nine toe to bar. The class will be set up uh, specifically so that after you get done with the ropes, you'll start your box jump between the rope and the box so that you end your seventh rep now on the same side as the rig. You'll go to the rig, you'll jump up, and you'll do your reps. Coaches, you could stagger them too as well. All right, so you got a two minute break between your rounds. So the only way to finish all nine intervals is to make sure that you get the round done in under two minutes. Um, and if you can't, you have to make adjustments to do so or you just won't do all the intervals, okay? Uh, work two minutes, well I shouldn't say that. Work as fast as you can, 90 seconds rounds is what we're looking for, but two minutes is gonna be the cap, all right? You have a two minute break and that is Tuesday. Wednesday, every two minutes for six rounds. Okay, so this is gonna be pretty much like a running clock. Zero to 12 minutes, you're gonna go ahead and do every two minutes for six rounds, three hang power cleans, two front squats, and then a jerk. You'll then rest two minutes and then go into a longer um, conditioning. It's five rounds for time. It has 21, 16 calories on the row, 50 double unders, and nine unbroken hang power clean and jerks. So you'll clean, you'll jerk, nine reps in a row. The weights are light, 95, 65, and they go down from there. You'll also take a 90 second rest between your breaks. So those rounds need to be done in three minutes or less. Um, back squat every three, I'm sorry, Thursday, back squat every three minutes times five. This is week number eight. So last week we went five, four, three, two, one. We're now going six, five, four, three, two. So you should be able to do at least the same weights or heavier depending on how last week felt. If you didn't do last week, be conservative on the rounds of six and five, but then get heavier on four, three, and two. Strict pull-ups is our strength accessory. Uh, four sets between every set um, between, not after. So once you're done with a set of two, there's no more pull-ups. Start breaking down the barbells and getting set up for three rounds for time. That is one, uh, one dumbbell, 20 dumbbell box step-ups, and then step down onto the same side, 30 alternating dumbbell snatches, five wall walk, three rounds, and that is for time on Thursday. Friday. Five rounds for time, six wall ball, five touch and go power cleans. You must touch and go then. So pick a weight you can do that you know you can do on the first round. And there's since there's four more after that, you can then make weight changes or weight adjustments as need, necessary, especially on this is all, all unbroken. So you need to do the six wall ball unbroken, five touch and go unbroken, nine wall ball unbroken, five touch and go power cleans unbroken. 12 wall ball unbroken. So you guys gotta start picking wall balls you can do unbroken. It'll give you a really good idea of, hey, I did the 12, it wasn't so bad, I can try the 14 now, all right? Uh, that has a rest two minutes in between every single round. It's really not that much of a rest break um, because again, we want you to push to go unbroken. So I'd rather you use a lightweight round one before the weights maybe you're trying to use all right, in the later rounds. Make it, build confidence in these movements, all right? Don't do singles because it's too heavy for you, all right? Um, Saturday, we are continuing our final week of Saturday Hero Workouts. This is a local person, uh, a, a Diller. I believe he was a police officer in New York. Um, it has a buy-in of 150 calories on any machine, all right? And we consider the machines uh, the rower or the bike air bike um, and 110 double unders. So 31 minute AMRAP, buy in with 105 calories, 110 double unders, 
Time remaining, you'll AMRAP 26 burpee, 35 air squat, seven deadlift, 225, 155. Sunday, 50, 40, 30, 20, 10, sit up double unders. You'll go ahead and do that back and forth, two to one on the singles. After you're done with that last round of 10, you'll do five rounds for time, 30 push up, 20 run, two under run, 10 strict pull up. That's our week, guys. Enjoy.